Brunei is a small sovereign state located on the island of Borneo in Southeast Asia. It is situated on the northwestern coast of the island, bordering the South China Sea. Brunei is surrounded by the Malaysian state of Sarawak and the Malaysian state of Sabah to the east, south, and west. Its exact geographic coordinates are 4.5353 degrees north, 114.7277 degrees east. Population of Brunei As of 2021, the estimated population of Brunei is around 442,400 people. Brunei is a small country with a relatively small population. The country's population is mostly concentrated in urban areas, with the capital city, Bundar Seri Begawan, being the largest city and the main center of population, with an estimated population of around 100,000 people. The majority of Brunei's population is ethnic Malay, and Islam is the predominant religion. Brunei, officially known as the Nation of Brunei, the abode of peace, is a sovereign state located on the island of Borneo in Southeast Asia. The history of Brunei can be traced back to the 7th century, when it was part of the Hindu Srivijaya Empire. The region later came under the influence of Islam in the 15th century, and by the 16th century, the Sultanate of Brunei had emerged as a powerful maritime empire. During the 19th century, Brunei came under the influence of European powers, with the British establishing a protectorate over the country in 1888. In 1906, Brunei became a British protectorate, with the Sultan retaining his throne as a figurehead. Brunei remained a British protectorate until 1984, when it gained full independence. During World War II, Brunei was occupied by Japanese forces, and after the war, it was again placed under British control. In 1959, a new constitution was introduced, which established a partially elected legislative council, and in 1970, a fully elected council was established. Following independence in 1984, Brunei developed into a modern, prosperous, and oil-rich state. The country's economy is heavily reliant on oil and natural gas, and the government has invested heavily in infrastructure, education, and health care. In recent years, Brunei has been the subject of controversy due to its strict Islamic laws, which include the imposition of the death penalty for homosexuality and adultery. The country has also been criticized for its lack of political freedoms, with the ruling sultan holding absolute power. Brunei has many beautiful places to visit, from stunning beaches to historic landmarks and cultural sites. Here are a few examples. Kampong Air. This is a traditional water village located in the capital city, Bundar Seri Begawan. The village is built on stilts above the water and offers a glimpse into traditional Bruneian life. Gerudong Park. This is an amusement park located in Gerudong, featuring a variety of rides and attractions, including a water park, a golf course, and a cinema. Istana Neural Iman. This is the official residence of the Sultan of Brunei and is one of the largest residential palaces in the world. It is not open to the public, but visitors can admire the palace's stunning architecture from the outside. Tasik Marambin. This is a nature reserve located in the Tutong district of Brunei. It is home to a large lake, which is surrounded by lush rainforest and is a great place for hiking, bird watching, and nature photography. Ulu Temburong National Park. This is a protected rainforest located in the Temburong district of Brunei. Visitors can explore the park's lush forest, see rare wildlife, and hike to the top of the park's canopy walkway for stunning views of the surrounding rainforest. Taman Tasik. This is a beautiful park located in the heart of Bundar Seri Begawan. It features a large lake, lush gardens, and several walking paths, making it a popular spot for picnics, jogging, and relaxation. These are just a few of the many beautiful places to visit in Brunei. Whether you're interested in culture, history, or nature, Brunei has something for everyone. Brunei's culture and traditions are heavily influenced by Islam, which is the predominant religion in the country. The country's traditional culture has been shaped by its history as a powerful maritime empire, as well as its position at the crossroads of Southeast Asia. One of the most important traditions in Brunei is the observance of Islamic holidays and festivals, such as Eid al-Fitr and Eid al-Adha. These festivals are marked by family gatherings, feasting, and prayers. Another important cultural tradition in Brunei is the art of silat, which is a form of martial arts that has been practiced in the country for centuries. Silat is often performed at cultural events and celebrations, and is an important part of Brunei's national identity. Brunei's cuisine is also an important part of the country's culture, with dishes that reflect the country's history and geography. 
Traditional Bruneian dishes include nasi katak, which is a simple rice and chicken dish, and ambayat, which is a starchy paste made from sago palm that is usually eaten with a variety of condiments. In terms of traditional clothing, Brunei's national dress is the bahu kering, which is a loose-fitting, ankle-length dress worn by women, and the bahu malayu, which is a traditional Malay outfit worn by men. Finally, Brunei's architecture is also an important part of the country's cultural heritage, with buildings that reflect a mix of traditional Malay, Islamic, and European styles. The Sultan Omar Ali Saifuddin Mosque in Bundar Seri Begawan is one of the country's most iconic landmarks, with its stunning golden dome and intricate marble work. Economy and Development Brunei has a small but wealthy economy that is heavily dependent on its oil and natural gas reserves. The country is a member of the Organization of the Petroleum Exporting Countries OPEC, and is one of the world's largest producers and exporters of oil and natural gas. The oil and gas industry account for the majority of the country's GDP, exports, and government revenues. The government of Brunei has invested heavily in infrastructure, education, and health care, and the country has a high standard of living, with one of the highest per capita incomes in the world. The country's development has been largely driven by its oil and gas industry, which has provided the government with the resources to invest in its people and infrastructure. In recent years, the government of Brunei has sought to diversify the economy away from oil and gas by promoting foreign investment and developing other industries such as tourism and agriculture. The government has also implemented a number of policies aimed at promoting entrepreneurship and innovation. Despite its small size, Brunei has a well-developed financial sector, with a number of international banks and financial institutions operating in the country. The country's currency is the Brunei dollar, which is pegged to the Singapore dollar. Brunei has also made efforts to promote sustainable development and environmental conservation. The country has established a number of protected areas, including the Ulu Temburong National Park, and has implemented policies aimed at promoting sustainable forestry and fishing practices. Overall, Brunei's economy and development have been driven by its oil and gas resources, but the government has made efforts to diversify the economy and promote sustainable development for the future. Travel Tips and Guide If you're planning to travel to Brunei, here are some tips and guides to help you make the most of your trip. Visa and Entry Requirements Most visitors to Brunei will require a visa, which can be obtained upon arrival at the airport or at a Brunei diplomatic mission. Check with the Brunei Immigration Department for the latest visa and entry requirements. When to visit? Brunei has a tropical climate, with high temperatures and humidity year-round. The best time to visit is between December and March when the weather is slightly cooler and drier. Getting around. The best way to get around Brunei is by car or taxi, as public transportation is limited. You can rent a car or hire a taxi from one of the many operators in the country. Language. Malay is the official language of Brunei, but English is widely spoken and understood, especially in tourist areas. Currency. The official currency of Brunei is the Brunei dollar, which is pegged to the Singapore dollar. Major credit cards are accepted at most hotels, restaurants, and shops. Culture and customs. Brunei is a Muslim country, and visitors should respect local customs and traditions. Dress modestly and avoid public displays of affection. It is also important to respect local laws, including restrictions on alcohol and drugs. Food. Brunei's cuisine is a blend of Malay, Chinese, and Indian influences, with plenty of fresh seafood, rice dishes, and spicy curries. Popular dishes include nasi katak, ambayat, and satay. Sightseeing. Brunei has a number of interesting attractions, including the Sultan Omar Ali Saifuddin Mosque, Kampong Air Water Village, and the Ulu Temburong National Park. Safety. Brunei is generally a safe country for travelers, with low levels of crime and a stable political climate. However, it's always a good idea to take common sense precautions to protect your safety and belongings. Health. Brunei has a good standard of health care, but it's always a good idea to take out comprehensive travel insurance before you go. Vaccinations for hepatitis A and B, and typhoid are recommended for travelers to Brunei.